Hi, this is Lauren. How to wear shawls, ponchos, and scarves and make it be really practical so we won't freeze and also to add another layer so we can be fashionable and stylish. I'm gonna start with shawls first. Big shawls are perfect. So you can carry it in the car, you can have it in your backpack. Uh, when you are traveling, you can have it in your carry-on. I actually line my bag with the shawl so it wouldn't be bulky. It's cold, I can just cover my legs or with the little ones, I can always put it next to the armrest and use it as a nice layer to keep it clean and comfortable. You can completely cover your saw, bring it up and belt it. That's one look. You have probably seen it a million times. Or wrap it around you. This is if you have a jacket or you don't have a jacket. seen everywhere you bring both sides together pass your hand through the loop behind your neck just like that have it both same length or if you want to make it interesting one longer, make one shorter. <laughs> Start from one corner and just wrap it several times and bring some of it up to your ear, tuck it in. And it can be very stylish. You can hang outside your jacket. <laughs> I'm gonna go to ponchos now. We're going to ponchos. I have one that is uh, like a turtleneck, so it really doesn't matter what you have under. And this is my safe one. Wish I had this when I, my baby was little. Uh, one time I went to my mom's house with my pajamas on. I could have slipped this on and no one would have known. <laughs> Okay, to keep your sanity. All right, this one is the turtle. If you find one like this, it's so, so practical. It is just like best thing ever to have. So turtle legs, so no one can see what you have on. Even if you have short sleeves, it's almost covered. Um, it's long. So if you go for walks, if you, you have to walk for a couple of blocks to get uh, to train, or go from class to class, it's nice and warm, and you can always have bulky sweater or very thin sweater under. So you can wear this from the beginning of winter till the very end, put your jacket on, you'd be nice and comfortable. I actually went and got a belt, so I can show you the poncho uh, with a belt on, just in case you wanna show your waistline easy to do and this is not a new look you have seen we all do this when we wear a poncho so it's a more bold belt it's woven so you can see it much better you can also um, put one with a nine uh, uh, rhinestones or a suede or something that shows itself even more so it can even add more uh, style to what you have on and if you don't want to show your belt, you don't have uh, anything like that, and you just a nice little skinny belt, just put that on and use some of the extra fabric from your poncho and just cover it. And that's a different look. <laughs> okay, this is another poncho, but it actually falls to one side, just like that. It has a symmetric look. So, you can actually be very creative with this. You can wear it like that. All it is is on one corner it has a little hole that you pass it through. Well, 
right above your shoulders. So you can either tilt it again, or what I do when I get hot, going in and out, I just drape it over me. Make it look like I have just a shawl to cover my neck. And then when I'm ready to go out, I cover myself in. So it's a very practical, very practical piece. And it's very light and my arms are completely out. So it looks like almost like a poncho or a cape. <laughs> it's a pretty look. This is my very long scarf. I actually call it my, I don't leave the house without you scarf because it has saved my life many times. It is very wide, very long, and it's not uh, anything expensive, it's acrylic. So I have just wrapped it around me, totally covered my shirt, and if I had a belt, I belted it or I just tucked it in. And it just covered my shirt, and I had I could wear the same shirt a couple of times without being embarrassed that I didn't even have enough clothes with me. The other way, I just wrap it around several times, just like that, and make it a knot, a front knot. And if I have a jacket on, that's the look. If I don't have a jacket on, I make it a little bit more stylish. I just one in the back, one in the front, and let it flow like that. <laughs> or I do the new trick everyone does. I fold it just like this, put it around my neck, pass my hand through the loop, take the rest, pass it through. Just like this. Two layers you can play with it and make it one long one if you like or just put it right in just imagine you have to block a few blocks and it's 19 degrees outside or just make it loose and cover your ears <laughs> these are for the long scarf now if you have a little short one you can still use that to keep you warm and I usually use them for uh, my wool sweaters when they are scratchy and I know many of you cannot wear wool or cashmere, I'm very well aware of that and I'm going to show you a trick that I usually use um, when I have a thick sweater like that on. It is all wool but I need it to keep me warm. So with a small scarf, either make a knot right in the front and tuck it in on the side or make the knot in the back. You know I'm gonna have a really messy hair after this. I'm gonna have to put it back on. Which I always put it all these two. And I have my hair down, it doesn't last long. <laughs> okay, this turns your regular sweater or a shirt, sweatshirt even, into a nice high neck, turtleneck, or a mock neck. <laughs> now, let's go to the long looped scarves. You have seen this everywhere. What you do is just wrap it around, it's just a big loop. And again, this is acrylic, but what it's doing is just adding more layers to your clothes. Not only keeping your neck warm, you can take it way up, put it over your hair, if it's freezing cold and you have to, or you just keep it loose. <laughs> Go like that, or just do it two layers. The best thing for this look is if you have a raincoat on. Instead of just looking like you have one, two layers on, this way you have a very chic, well put together look. Either like that, or just a little bit looser. And over your jacket. I love these. They're good. 
because they're practical and you can make them into so many different looks, shapes, and if you want to keep, if you want them to keep you warm, they will, and if just stylish, you can just make them loose, just hang over as a second layer to your clothing. This one, I wear this all the time in winter time. It is cashmere and it's solid. My husband has actually wore this. We were somewhere and it was absolutely cold. I couldn't stand it. And I had another scarf, so I let him have this. That's another good thing. If you uh, find some that are just solids, get those also because they're very practical. So anyone in the family can wear them. You don't have to worry about patterns or looks. So that's another look. And it's just one piece of cashmere and you can get them in wool too I have seen them and you just slide it over <laughs> it's nice and warm all right I was going to show you a different look in case you have a very dressy jacket on uh, you're at work and you want to add a few accessories to make it very stylish and if you're going out afterwards or uh, you just want to make yourself look very good if you're having dinner out with some friends I have some uh, nice leather gloves, which I'm going to add to my very simple scarf. The way I'm going to wear this, I'm going to bring the collar up, wrap the loop around me. This is my loopy scarf. And if it's cold, I'm going to make it very tight just like that and if it's not I will keep it nice and loose just over my jacket and I will accessorize it with my mom gloves gloves hats shawls scarves ponchos they make a winter look so much more stylish and fashionable and they're practical so there you are stylish and fashionable for a dinner out <laughs> now if you're wearing a sweater and you know it is going to bother you either it has a mix of wool or cashmere in it or like me after a while when your your skin gets warm it starts uh, itching and you start scratching yourself driving yourself crazy what I usually do is I take a scarf and I wrap it around my neck and then I just tuck it in uh, that way I have a layer of soft cotton or silk next to me. You can't see it, but I can feel the nice soft fabric next to my skin instead of getting a scratchy. And when it comes to sweaters that I know have a mix and they are going to keep me nice, warm and wonderful, they're comfortable, but I know after a while I'm going to start scratching myself. I pair it with a very thin silk or very thin cotton shirt which you can't see and it won't be bulky so that would be a very nice protection with uh, fabrics that might irritate your skin I want to show you a more casual look I changed it to blue jeans and I want to try a few of the scarves and the shawls with just a little small jacket a very versatile jacket that you might wear to work. Um, please remember to subscribe. We love to hear about your comments and we love you to like our videos and we really really love it when you subscribe so please don't forget to subscribe. All right so I have blue jeans on and a little jacket and I'm wearing the big loop scarf. So I just have it very loose on as you can see can bring the collar up and make it more warm looking still very stylish go with the lighter pink one you know I had my orange one out so let's say you went out and you did expect I'm sure you're checking the weather when you're out <laughs> 
that when you come home and it's after uh, dinner time and it's kind of late, so you take your nice shawl out of your backpack or your big bag and you cover yourself with your shawl. There. So you have your arms free, which you can carry your bags and you can walk quickly from block to block to get to where you need to go. And it's just blue jean. Blue jean's a nice little jacket and a nice warm shawl that you have wrapped around you. And you can also do <laughs> the loop <laughs> that I love because it's so easy. There. And just drape it over you. Remember, it's cold and you don't have a coat with you, but just a shawl. <laughs> That's not a bad look, right? It's a very cute look. And it's comfortable, it's stylish, and it's keeping you warm. I was going to show you just some more gloves. They are very nice, easy accessory to your winter clothes. They can be leather or they can be wool, cashmere, uh, or just fun little designs, pom-poms, the fingerless ones are always fun to have around. You can hold on to your coffee cup when you have those on. Cashmere gloves or the long ones. They are fun and they are easy to buy and easy to mix with your winter clothes. Thank you again for watching. I always have fun when I'm playing dress up. Please subscribe and please tell your friends to subscribe our house resort YouTube channel. Thank you again. See you soon.